So welcome back and as requested, we're going to be going over this um, eight marker, which always comes up and you have to talk about ethical issues, privacy issues, legal issues, sometimes cultural, sometimes environmental. So I realize that not a lot of people have gone through this. And in this video, we're going to go over how to answer it as well as tips that you can use to answer this question and get the full eight marks. So let's dive straight in. Um, a shopping centre has a security system that includes CCTV cameras to record uh, activities in the centre. The security system is being upgraded to include um, the use of facial recognition to identify track the movements of and record individuals throughout the uh, shopping centre. Discuss the positive and negative impacts of the upgrade, you, including ethical issues, privacy issues and legal issues. So remember, discuss. We have to talk about positives and negatives. You can't come to this question when you have five minutes remaining. You have to have at least 15 uh, minutes to answer this uh, question in good detail and get the full eight marks. So make sure you um, also, one key thing is make sure you plan this answer. Yeah, You can't just dive straight in. You have to, because there is a lot to talk about, you have to get all of your thoughts first and then like, um, shape it up in a way that you can link everything um, accordingly. So ethical issues refers to what is right and wrong. So what is right about this um, situation? Well, what's right? So um, if, you ha if you're in a shopping center and something bad happens unexpectedly, then there's footage there which shows the exact movements of the person that did something to you. So that's a positive, um, ethical issues, if something happens, there's evidence. Now, what is something like a counteractive point we can say? Not counteractive, but whatever. What's a negative, what's a negative we can say? Well, negative can actually overlap with some of the other issues. So we can talk about how um, they don't know where the data, where the data is being stored, being stored, or how long, or uh, why it's being stored. Um, yeah, so this is, again, we can link this to Data Protection Act, which is our legal issues. So with legal issues, make sure you, um, depending on the question, use a legislation. This is what this is why you learn the three legislations. So copyright, um, DPA, and uh, the Misuse Act. So make sure you know your acts and act accordingly. So privacy issues is uh, we can talk about consent as they're not given consent, like whether to record or not. But what's a positive thing? Well, because it is, since it's, uh, since it's um, a public uh, space, you can record. So this is kind of like, uh, again, we're using a negative and then we're doing a positive. Negative, positive. We have to do that in order to uh, fulfill the uh, point of discuss. Uh, what else can we uh, include? Um, and yeah, this is all I can think of on top of my head. But um, let's go through a model example, which I have um, answered. So, so here is the model example. And we can read it. So the upgrade of the shopping center security system to include facial recognition technology brings positive and negative implications. This is just the intro. And then we dive straight into the ethics. So firstly, the ethics can be questioned. For example, a positive is that since the since it is a CCTV, actually you should have said, it is um, since it's a, since there is a CCTV that includes facial recognition. Users may feel safer because they know that any actions are being monitored if anything unexpected does happen. So, uh, 
I did write it right now, but <laughs> yeah. As long as you make the spag better, it should be fine. But I've mentioned all of the facts, which is important. So, so this is the first thing we said. Then, however, now we're going to um, use like a negative and say, however, they have not been informed or have given consent, which is our privacy issues. Furthermore, there are also legal issues. Now we're talking about the legal issues as there is no, um, as users are not informed how long the data will be kept, if the data is secure, and the reason for the data to be collected, which is potentially breaking the Data Protection Act 2018. And now this is our legal issue done. Now we can link this back to the privacy issues. Moreover, there are many privacy issues as users may feel it is an invasion of privacy, having the camera track every single move. That's a privacy issue. And however, it can also be argued that users are in a public place Hence, they, are, they can be recorded by anyone at any time, which is basically a positive and a negative. So these are the points you must include. And yeah, as long as you give a balanced argument, so positives and negatives, you would be in a good, po a good spot to get the highest band mark. So six, seven, eight. Make sure also, make sure you link it. That's very key. So if there is a way you can link ethical to legal, maybe privacy to legal, always link and give a well-structured argument. So yeah, this is a quick video on how to, exp how to um, answer this eight marker. Hopefully you found this useful and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.